Okay, guys, now we're going on to Alex Pereira, the final fight. Who wins? How did he win? What about find out? Let's jump straight. So, Alex Sandro uh, Silva Pereira. Uh, he is 36 years old. He is a light heavyweight. He's six foot four. How tall was uh what's it? Oh, I've got rid of the pass in there. I think uh Yuri Prosko is six three. They've got the same amount of reach, roughly. Uh he's on a one win streak where Prosko's on what a 13, maybe less. I think it was like 13. Uh he's fought quite recent, more recent at least than Prosko. Prosko hasn't fought in a year, and obviously Pereira has fought recently affiliations you know you can read all of this and get what you want from it he's currently number two of fighter of the year last year and Prohoshka was number one uh current best mma light heavyweight fighter he's number seven current pound for pound he's number 14 uh he's a top fan favorite number 23 and he's number 12 of the greatest striker of all time which if you watched the last video i said that you know, there's a more chance that he gets knocked out by Prohoska. Now, in this video, we're going to explain why I believe Pereira will actually win. Who actually wins this? Now, here's all the stats, right? For three TKOs in round one, two in round two, one in the fifth round, one in the second, one in the third, one unanimous and one uh, split. If it goes to a knockout, Pereira wins because... I have, like, this is one reason why. He is the greatest MMA striker of all time in number 12. Like, Prohoska wasn't on there. So, I have a feeling that Pereira's, if it's going to go to Pereira, a ran two, three, or four knockout. That's what I'm saying. Two, three, or four. I do not believe there will be a submission from Pereira. So, if there is a submission, it will be from Prohoska. And if there is a decision, I'm going to edge it towards Prohoska. But I, feel, I have a feeling that uh, Pereira is going to want it more. So he's just going to be trying to force the fight. You know, I feel like he's going to control the fight. He's going to uh, adjust pace and all that. He's going to he's gonna make sure that his lead foot is always in front of uh, in front of Pereira. And yeah, I feel like... I feel like that Pereira will win via knockout. So obviously he's got five wins, one losses in the UFC, and the Legacy Fighting Air Alliance, he's got one win and zero losses. The biggest loss on the card is this. His biggest loss, I do believe, will be Izzy. Uh, but, yeah. There is, wow, there's a lot of fights here. So what does that say? Eight and oh? There is no way that's eight fights. Yeah, there's no way. That's like all of his fights. Yeah, that's all of his fights. Yeah, uh, you, we can't really go via experience then, can we? Because he's got loads of fights and wins. So this this one really could just go either way. But I believe that... I think Pereira's going to either knock him out or win by a decision. A decision is least likely. A knockout is most likely. But a submission, if it does happen, I don't see Pereira. Motion detected at the front door. I don't see Alex Pereira uh, submitting him. I, I can see a loss by submission. 50% of his losses are because of this. So, okay, so his two losses are either by knockout, which was this one, and then there's oh, that's a decision one. Hmm. I do believe that he gets knocked out. It's either... <laughs> This fight is so hard to call. A lot of MMA guys are going to be like, no, you're wrong. You don't know what you're talking about. It's such a hard fight to call. Do you know what? I'm going to go guts. I'm going to go guts. Pereira gets it done by knockout. Decision. And I think he loses by submission. I feel like that's that's probably the best bets here. And uh, I feel like submission will be Prohaska. Prohaska will win via knockout as well. So they both can win by a knockout. One, one will win by a submission, and I believe Pereira wins by decision. So they both have a way of actually winning. They both have a way of actually losing. And then they both can go either way with a TKO. But that's all I've got for this video. Let me know if I'm wrong. Let me know if I'm right. Let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you in a bit. Peace.